BAT. The Panthers are prepared to return the kickoff. And this is Whitaker running it out. And it's the same as a touchback as he's tackled right at the 20. The Panthers will try to put a little drive together and not give the football away, Bill, as each team seems to like one on uh, treat it like it's a hot potato. Well, sometimes it is a hot potato. Did you know back in 1985, Jim, I set a record for fumbles in a football season? It wasn't easy to do, but I accomplished it. It was a lot of hard work, and I got it done. Good job that time by the secondary. They're in good position. They make the play, and it's an incomplete pass by the quarterback. Failing to complete that one. So, second down here. The Cardinals set at the line. Dime package. Newton's going to take the snap from the shotgun. Locked in on the football and has hold of it with two hands. No time to huddle now. First and ten. Looking across the middle. Now they take the football onto the opponent's side of the field. Looks like they're in press coverage here. Down the field, and it falls incomplete. It's nice to have a good arm and throw the football down the field like this, but that time just overthrew the open receiver. Newton has everybody split out wide for this snap. Throws the pass. Makes the reception. And he's taken down, but not until he picks up the first. Getting set as fast as they can. First down and ten. Dixon's got it. On a pass, had some heat on it. Oh, we got us a nice drive going here, Jim. Another first down. They are just making one solid play after another and just marching down the field. That's what all defensive coordinators love to see when they don't have to blitz and one of their defensive linemen gets a sack without any blitzing. The Cardinals go with the dime formation here on defense. Dixon, touchdown. This game is tight. Phil, they knew they had to get something on the board here early in the fourth, and now they've done it, and there is hope. They've been scratching and clawing all day long, and they finally got the play that puts them back in this game. It's close. Now, can you finish it off by making one more play to take the lead? Johnson's running this one out. And he's tackled right at the 30-yard line after that return. The Cardinals offense back on the field trying to make up for that costly mistake. The last time they had the ball, the turnover they committed immediately turned into points against them. Yeah, it did, Jim, but you know what? It's not a perfect game. you got to deal with adversity when you're talking about football. So you made that mistake. Let it go and go out there, be aggressive, and see if you can score some points. Palmer's got it in the gun. Andre Ellington with the reception. The Cardinals are really a true football team. Their defense, we know it's good. They don't want to just rely on it. The offense, nice job picking up that first down. Eat the clock up. Keep the pace of the game on your side. Small lead here in the second half. That was a good job. Ellington's got it on the handle. It's now second down and seven after the three-yard rush. Let's go, let's go. Ellington's taking the handoff. Tackle down right around the 48. That was a predictable play call here in the fourth quarter. You got a, you got a little lead, and you're trying to run the football to run out the clock, but the defense is ready and stopped it for a short game. Johnson is in the backfield. Third and five. Chris Johnson with the reception. And he's going to be tackled, and that's going to bring us to fourth down. You have a lead in the fourth quarter. You got the football. You want to keep it. Not a very good play call there. So now it's up to your defense to try to stop and win the game. Going for it on fourth down. 
leading and with possession of the football, a good place to be at this point in the game. Michael Floyd throws it in. Well, you got a small lead in the second half, and you go for it on fourth down. That is a risky proposition, but the head coach took a big sigh of relief over there on the sideline because they picked it up. Good job by the offense. Palmer's completion percentage, 70% on the day. Let's go, let's go. Why, 18? Why, 18? First and 10. Ellington's going to secure the handoff. Hey, the NFL, it's about adversity you must overcome. That time, the runner gets in there and scores a touchdown. Even though he'd fumbled earlier, he did not let it bother him. He got it done this time. The point after is good. The Cardinals are ready to kick it away. They'll take it at the 20. The Panthers heading back onto the field on offense. They scored on their last drive, Phil, and they did it with a blistering aerial attack. Quarterback is hot. He is getting protected. Oh, man, what do you do now? I think if you're an offensive coordinator, it doesn't matter what you call. You know your guys are going to make it work. Newton in shotgun formation. Greg Olson going to take it the distance. The 30, the 20. The 10, and he's in for the touchdown. What a play. What a run. Tight ends are a position where you got to be able to do it all. You got to be able to block, run routes, and you got to be able to get in position so you have a chance to catch the touchdown pass. Good job of the tight end. Touchdown. The Panthers getting set for the kickoff. He's got a chance to return this one. And they stop him from running it out to the 20. Mark him down at the 19. The Cardinals take the field as both offenses have just exploded here in a very exciting fourth quarter. Well, this game is done for the faint of heart. What I mean by that is don't lose your courage right now. You, you're working well on the offensive side and keep calling those plays and try to take it down the field and score points. And they're going to call a timeout here to stop the clock. That last running play was good for only a yard, so it's second down and nine. Homer's going to take it from the gun. Ellington with the grab. Ellington is tackled down. That's going to be a pickup of six. They call for the timeout to stop the clock. This is third down. The Cardinals line up, split backfield. Palmer's back in shotgun formation. Finds Gresham. Gresham's tackled down at the 29. Nice job that time by the defense, knowing the situation. Go ahead and let the quarterback complete the pass. Just make sure you come up and make the tackle before the first down. Good job. Fourth down coming up. They bring back out the offense to go for it. They'll go for it on fourth down, late stages. Back at the line. They're going for it on fourth. The Cardinals turn the ball over on downs. Late in the fourth quarter, and that play by the defense could decide this game, Phil. Awesome job by the defense coming up big in that situation. I'm just going to say this real plain and simple. Did not like the decision on the offensive side. The Panthers get set to snap the football. Only one timeout remaining here in the fourth. First down. Pressure on every snap now. Two hands on the football and has the catch. The Cardinals signal for a timeout. They have two remaining.
The Panthers head to the line. They've got one timeout left in the game. Now first and ten. Jonathan Stewart with the football. Gets about nine on the play. That's a timeout by the defense. Every play is huge now. Second down on the way. Playing press coverage to the outside. Second and two. Colbert's brought down, but not until he gives his team a new set of downs. Good job that time by the offense. They pick up a first down inside the 20-yard line. Now we'll see if they can punch it in and get seven points. Now on first down, every snap crucial the rest of the way. First and goal from the six. The give out of the eye. Stewart's met after a gain of three. They're just grinding away down here, inching closer to the end zone. Well, that's what you got to do sometimes. It's hard always to think that you're going to come out and just make big plays. You got to do the dirty work, and this offense is doing it right now. Second down, late in the fourth quarter. Huge play coming up down near the goal line. Touchdown in the late stages. And with that touchdown, this game looks almost certain to be headed for overtime. Yeah, you know with Jim, it, it could go into overtime. And when it goes into overtime, your strategy must change. you got to know the situations. I think it makes you, as a coach, become more aggressive. The corners are going to meet the receivers right on the line of scrimmage. Away from the ball, there's a flag down on the field. Players from both sides made an appeal, but the referees say it's on the defense. They wanted more excitement, more tension, more decision making. It's the second guess in the NFL. And now they're going to have it. This two point conversion, more teams are going to do it because they don't want to kick the extra point from the 15 yard line. Why go for the point after when you can win it with a two point try? They convert and they take the lead in the late going. Well, we've seen this all day long, haven't we? Uh, the coach has been very aggressive in his game management decisions, and he stayed with it that time. He didn't back off. And that was a great call to pick up the two points. Get ready. Palmer standing back in the shotgun ready for the snap. Floyd's there to catch the ball that had a lot of heat on it. It was a nail biter. It wasn't pretty, but it goes down as a victory. It's even sweeter when you win a close game in the league because you know how hard it is. And to make that one play, that was the difference. Woo, a lot of joy in the locker room. So for Bill Sims and all the crew at EA Sports, Jim Nance saying so long for now.